Hey guys, Casey Sanglins here at Guarantee RV in Junction City, Oregon. Today I'm going to show you this new 2018 Jayco 287 bunkhouse, the 287 BHSW. Uh, this is the Rocky Mountain Edition. I'll get into a little bit of that here as we go along. But starting around, of course, you got the, the power tongue jack in front, the dual propane bottles up, up, on, up front. Uh, it's also pre wired for solar panels. You get a little portable solar panel there. Uh, got the nice diamond plate to go with the Rocky Mountain Edition. Nice diamond plate, lower lower part of the cap. Keep those those rock chips down. Uh, around the side, you've of course got your nice full pass through storage. Plenty of room for all your goodies and stuff in there. And then you've got a nice, almost full length awning. Uh, speakers in the awning for your outside speakers. Those are really nice. When the when the awning's out, it gives you a nice. Uh, nice sound, but the, the speakers aren't blasting right at your neighbors, kind of points back at the trailer. Um, of course, under the awning, you've, you've still got the full power or the full length LED light strip underneath as well. Um, walking around the back, uh, nice thing here, you've got a door that goes directly to the bathroom. We'll show you that inside. Uh, back here is all your connections. You've got the outside shower. This is a bunkhouse, so it's nice. You got kids, you got dogs, you're uh, assumably a family. Nice place to kind of hose off a little bit, hose your feet off before you go into the trailer. Uh, back here, <clears throat> your power, satellite input, uh, and some extra storage back here. This is underneath the bottom bunk. So, again, plenty of storage for all of this stuff. You got kids, you're going to need it. Uh, let's go inside and take a look what the inside looks like. All right, uh, this is the inside. Again, I said this is a, uh, a Rocky Mountain edition, so let's go over a couple of the things that the Rocky Mountain package gets you. Uh, starting off, you get the nice uh, sink covers, which doesn't come in the standard SLXs. You get this nice roll-up, I call it a sushi roll, uh, but it is a sink cover, very usable. It's strong enough to place stuff on it. Also, you can dry your dishes on it. Um, you also get a little upgraded stereo here, which is very nice. Bluetooth, uh, it is a CD player, inside, outside speakers, all controlled through there. Um, better than the standard one. Uh, the other big thing is the toilet, is the porcelain toilet. We'll see that in a minute. But the biggest thing with the Rocky Mountain Edition is that you get a full 80 gallons of fresh water capacity. That is huge, especially if you got kiddos. That's a lot of showers, a lot of toilet flushing, a lot of hand washing that goes, goes along with that. And with this, you've got, excuse me, you've got the water to do it. Um, up here in the front, you've of course got mom and dad's bedroom. Nice hanging wardrobes on either side. Uh, LED reading lights under here. Plenty of storage space to fold some clothes or put your bags. You've got the bed lifts up, of course, that goes through to the full pass-through storage. There is hookups for a TV back here. And the nice thing, you've got windows on either side. So plenty of cross ventilation, plenty of light, um, not feel so dungeony in here. Uh, pocket sliding door out here. Uh, they've done some nice, nice touches, little coat racks, places to hang your stuff, nice little bench to put your, put your feet on or put your shoes on rather, and a nice little, another storage place, but whatever. Plenty of cabinets up above all around with the nice glass inserts really does a nice, adds a little nice touch to it. Uh, nice couch with more storage up above. This is a jackknife sofa. Uh, so it is extra sleeping for a shorter, short, shorter person, but it also gives you nice storage underneath. With the jackknife sofa, you get the nice big U-shaped dinette. The biggest thing about these that me personally I like is when this is folded down into a bed, you get a lot longer bed so that an adult, an adult or, a, or a taller kid can sleep there. Um, there's still storage underneath the dinette as well. Uh, the bunkhouse, this is the nice thing about, or this is the reason it's called a bunkhouse, is of course you've got the bunks. Um, Jayco, they actually put a ladder in here so that the kids, you're not throwing kids up there and they're not falling down. They can actually climb up the ladder. Uh, there is lights both on the top and the bottom bunk uh, and a window as well. Both of them have the curtain so they can get a little bit of privacy. Um, let's go into the bathroom. Bathroom, again, very usable. Nice, uh, nice big tub or a nice big shower. This thing's huge. It's not a tub, but it's a, there's a ton of room in this shower. And I'm six foot, and it's still plenty of headroom. 
Uh, nice toilet. Again, this is a porcelain toilet, not a plastic toilet. And like we said outside, the door that goes right into the bathroom. So as the kids are dirty, playing, whether it's kids, company, whatever, outside you can come right into the bathroom without tracking dirt all the way through your trailer. Nice sink, medicine cabinet, everything you need in the bathroom. Uh, out here, the kitchen area, the galley, you got plenty, plenty more storage. You got a hanging wardrobe here for the kids' clothes, um, or you can take that out and use it for extra food if you need. Nice set of drawers here. Two more big uh, pantry locations. And then, of course, the big fridge and freezer. You have to have plenty of food and beverages with kids. Three burner stove and the proper oven. Uh, again, this is the 2018 Jayco 287 BHSW. My name is Casey Sanguins. If you have any questions on this or anything else we may have in stock, give me a call. My phone number is 541-953-9171. Look forward to hearing from you. Thanks.